Hello and welcome to the show. So I'm sorry you're all very excited you haven't just read the title of this video. Uh, in case you have forgotten, a while ago now I was doing a speedrun with an ultimate arrow. And basically a Prius ruined it. And in that video I vowed that I would get revenge on the Prius. So here we are. We are going to destroy... In fact we're going to destroy two Priuses. Prius... Uh, does anybody know the plural of Prius? Uh, uh, <laughs> Prius are you? Pri, I, I don't know. We're going to destroy some <laughs> Priuses. I think I, I don't know. We're, you know what we're going to destroy? Uh, because yeah, it basically ruined a speedrun. I would put the video in here, but I can't find it on my computer, so it's probably on walkabouts. I'll put the link in the description in case you haven't seen the speedrun, so you can see uh, exactly why it is we're getting revenge on this car. So this is how the challenge is going to work. Daniel is driving the blue Prius. I am driving the red one, and we're going to try and do a lap of the Hockenheim shorts. It's, the, uh, it's not quite the short. It's the middling circuit. I can't remember. National. National, I think. I think, yeah. We're going to try and do a lap or until the cars get destroyed. Damage is on simulation. So, yeah. Uh, they're probably not going to survive very long. Now, we're going to have three they're chase not cars. Fantastic. Uh, <laughs> no, they're really not. We've got three chase cars. These are going to be the Range Rovers. We're using the Hummers, but it actually turns out the Hummers standard can't keep up with the Prius. Uh, so, <laughs> yeah, we had to swap. We would upgrade the Hummers, but the lobby was being so laggy that since we're all here and connected, we just stayed here. So, uh, are you feeling confident? Uh, <laughs> uh, not in the slightest, no, because the Range Rovers are quicker than the Prius, the Priuses, Priuses, whatever it's called. Um, yeah, so I got a, was it a three second head yes, start? It was a three, second, three second head start. Ignore the and, little bit um, of lag, there are some problems. There was a tad lag, but we don't. Do, I was just incredible at driving. Um, yes, yeah, so this was the first corner, and um, I, I, I dodged one actually. I was quite happy with how I yeah, dodged one. Yeah, got past one. But I then after impressed. that, I just got absolutely munched, um, and that pretty much wrecked my car. I think I had at that point it was I had front aero damage, like engine damage, and drivetrain, and everything like went wrong. And the Range Rovers were fine. Yeah, the, your car had taken a fair whack. It's sort of now flying through the air. Uh, wee, in a nice flip there. That, uh, is, <laughs> see, that is how good I am at driving. Ah, uh, some spectacular driving. So, yes, as you can tell, uh, you made it to about the first corner. Yeah, in fact, you're coming backwards. Camera uh, so got lost. <laughs> you were trying to get away from them and ended up sort of attempting to sort of do a reverse J-turn. It was the only way. Uh, yeah, the J-turn didn't work and I just got punted again. It um, didn't really work. So, so now in the you end, go I sort of back down the straight. Going backwards. Uh, which isn't the right now you see now you've gone past the finish line a little bit of flying everyone else was having many laughs at this point uh, yeah <laughs> in fact the Range Rovers from my attempt were actually who were messing about realised they should probably get off the track again uh, because you're yeah. going back this um, way and this like crash hug thing just killed my car and that was it that was yeah. the end of the that was the end of my uh, my drive I got I don't know what that was Um, I got like 50 foot f uh, further than the first corner. Yeah, you so really not fantastic. Didn't survive, and you ended up even further back. No. So, we move on to my attempt. Now, um, to be honest, if I didn't move off the start finish line, I would technically beat you because you were killed behind the start finish line. So, I didn't really have a huge <laughs> amount to do to kind of win this challenge. So, I'm, I'm feeling fairly confident. I'm not expecting to survive much, much after the sort of first corner. The three second head start isn't really that much because the Prius is F class, the Land Rovers are. Oh, God. C. I remember. I think in C, C or D. They're quite a lot faster. I think they're C. Oh, yeah, I think they are because they're, they're the, uh, the supercharged one. So I had a slightly different tactic. My tactic was to sort of keep to the wall. Uh, the idea is that they'd have a harder time of trying to spin me out. And I was going to shortcut the first corner a little bit, but then I found some sticky stuff on the grass, and well, <laughs> it created chaos. Uh, all the Land Rovers are now broken, uh, and two are stuck on their side, and one is broken, and I'm fine. I took rather heavy damage to the sort of the rear of the car, but the Prius is absolutely fine. Uh, as you can see, I may have caused some carnage. Because uh, the damage is on simulation. That was impressive. I, yeah, the, the damage on simulation, so the cars can't roll over. They're stuck there on their sides. Uh, and the one Land Rover that isn't broken complete, or one Land Rover that isn't on its side and could move, is got a destroyed engine. And so, yeah. I killed three Land Rovers in one corner with a Prius, and wait, that's not what. What? Hell, that's not supposed to work like that. We're supposed to be uh, killing. It <laughs> shouldn't happen to us. If you can kill a Prius. 
If you no, sorry, oh, that's your damage there. That's yeah. not a lot of damage. This, this is the damage. Now the reason why this, I, I guess the reason why the Land Rover took such heavy damage is basically I ran into the sticky stuff and pretty much stopped dead, and then the Land Rovers ploughed into the back of me. So you can see there, differential drivetrain. I like how just one brake disc and one shock absorber destroyed the other side's completely fine. Uh, the yeah. gearbox also took a, a well, is annihilated, uh, but the engine importantly isn't broken. Of course, if we'd done this in a real car, yeah, that price would be utterly dead. But Forza decides that it can carry on. Uh, and here we go, zoom and a little bit further around the lap. And there we go. One of the black Land Rovers, where's it gone, was trying to make things a little bit difficult for me. But even then, I still managed to finish with a little bit of style. And I, that shouldn't well, work. Well, you're in a Prius, so style no, isn't I'd, really... Admittedly, no. Style doesn't really count. There is a huge uh, amount of style. You did complete a lap. I, I will admit, you completed yeah. a lap. I can't believe. So, I sent the Land Rovers around to... The complete the rest of the lap to save the replay because they're going to be faster and then I set about trying to rescue some of the Land Rovers again not something I was expecting to say uh, I'm <laughs> going to be honest Other I had way around, you would have thought yeah uh, to be honest I had one of the the most sort of working cars uh, here the black Land Rovers had survived fairly well somehow despite annihilating your car that one there hadn't that one was quite badly damaged as you no can that see. one was quite that was the one that if you saw that just needed a front flip when it hit me when I was going backwards yeah so that was um it was, that was a the dead one. Proving quite difficult, shall we say, to roll Mine over was just totally annihilated at this point. Yeah, Mine was just over on the start finish line. Over in the corner. Uh, I was trying to work and try to get these Land Rovers rolled over. Turns out it's not very easy. Uh, the Land Rover that was destroyed at the first corner had kind of got moving a little bit. You can see he's not moving particularly well. Uh, I was attempt trying all sorts of things to get these Land Rovers to roll over. Now you'll see I'm using reverse. The reason why I'm doing this is to avoid damaging my engine. Uh, if you hit it with the back of the car, since the back of my car is already destroyed, doesn't really matter. Whereas you hit them with the front of your car, you're going to damage your engine. And then my car's not going to work at all. Uh, it wasn't really working getting these Land Rovers rolled over, so I'm going to do some celebratory so donuts. So you did some reverse sort of. donuts in, instead. So that's <laughs> yeah. Fair enough, I can understand that. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, I tried for a really big run up uh, in the hope that it might flip it over, and nope, that's, no, I flipped it over. Yeah, but now you, you, you've made it worse, actually, to be fair. <laughs> yeah, I didn't really help. Uh, that one there is now completely stuck. So, yeah, things weren't going so well for the Land Rovers. I then decided to be a nice guy, and I was going to push the one thing that was on its wheels back to the pits. Again, I wasn't expecting to see a Prius pushing a Land Rover to the... That it's should, something you don't see every day, let's be fair. No, this shouldn't work. We just, this has all gone wrong. Um, oh, yeah, he decides to go over and hit you just for good measure, because your car's not dead enough as it is already. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I think I think if you hadn't shown... I think telemetry of mine was literally... 100% everywhere, I think, by the gearbox that was about 85 or something. Yeah, your car, like took, uh, your car was destroyed, and the two Range Rovers on their side were destroyed. Uh, so there we go. Uh, this, this wasn't the conclusion we were supposed to come to. We were supposed to no. destroy the... Well, it was for me, but not Ah, physics is broken. Oh, the physics is just gone. <laughs> oh, I don't know what... Please, the, fix, the, the, please fix that do. in the next game. Yeah, can't do pit stops. Well, to be fair, pit stops are never really used normally in Forza uh, no. because the tyres never run. Tire anyway. degradation needs to be sorted as well. Yes, that is something. However, from the Forza Five sort of video, the very brief video, it does look like the tyres had degradation on it, but that could just be yes. Uh, it did look like that though. So fingers are we crossed. We hopefully will do a video uh, on that soon for that. Yes, we will have to. However, there we go. That is it for the well, kind of killing of a Prius. We killed one. Prius, Prius, whatever it's called. Uh, I some somehow I survived and rescued some Land Rovers. Um, yeah, that's not worked. I, we may have to rethink no, this. No, it wasn't uh, the conclusion it, I was the, expecting. The Prius has beaten us again. God damn it! Uh, yeah. <laughs> so yes, that is it for this video, guys. Thank you very much for watching. As ever, if you have challenges, please do leave them in the comment section. We will have a look through and we will pick our favourites, and they will probably end up in a video. However, until next time. Goodbye. Prius. That is the plural of Prius. There we go. We come up with a with a solution. Oh <laughs> yeah.